Wednesday, which will help raise snow levels back to 6,000 to 7,000 feet and uh, help decrease winds some. A cold front along the Canadian border will sag south over the plains on Wednesday. That should allow for a light rain over the plains and more snow in the mountains and a rain-snow mix along the High Line as temperatures start to decrease. A deep low pressure trough will then start to push the high pressure ridge out of the area on Thursday and that'll continue a good feed of Pacific moisture over a shallow... Oh, we don't need to go on and on about that, but they were just talking about wind gusts of over 70 miles an hour, which is a Cat 1 hurricane where I'm from, um, uh, maybe gusts 65 miles an hour, um, and uh, light rain, which is something you always want to hear about light rain when it's uh, freezing. So we've got that in store for us, perhaps this week. Um, once you've been through the weather uh, from Louisiana here through all the, um, uh, anyway, it, it's not more comforting to me. It's not like, oh, okay, well now, um, I kind of know what to expect and you know, it'll be fine. No, it's, ah, you know, rain, um, ah, cat one hurricane force winds blasting down the Rocky Mountains, um, ah, more snow, um, it, it's really, it's not comforting, although it, I guess at least you kind of know that you need to leave earlier or whatever, so, um, again, it's not, um, Comforting. Sorry, it's blurry, but I've got this new phone. I have no fucking idea how to use it. 